All right, welcome to part five. Today we're going to make an NPC with movement, dialogue, and a quest item. Let's go to the sci-fi farm and let's make a, a farmer NPC. So again, make sure you're inventing mode. Double click. Let's, uh, let's pick a character or make one, whichever you prefer. All right, let's go with this old grandpa dude. Let's just give him random movements. We'll make him very, very slow. But we'll make him move around a lot. And action button. Okay. So, arm, grandpa. So we're going to make a sort of little quest here. So first, let's right click, show text, and let's find his face for a little grandpa. All right, whatever. We'll just go with this guy. Farm Grandpa. Okay, so he says, Hey there. You've got some huge... Now I want this to be dramatic, so we're going to copy and paste so I don't have to do all that all over again. And that's already there. You've got some huge ambitions. Ho, ho, ho. All right, and then we're gonna paste again. Um, what should he? Would you like me to be your sugar daddy? All right, and now you're gonna get to answer a question. So we're gonna double click and show choices. This is where you get to put multiple choice options. So we got yes and no, perfect. But just make it more fun. Yes, daddy. Or no, you gross old man. When you see here, when yes, everything in here will happen. And when no, everything will happen in here. So yes, daddy. Um, actually, let's just paste again. Um, Oh yeah, I'm gonna make it rain. And then Farm Grandpa has given you a hundred and twenty dollars. And uh, just because you said it gave, whoops, just because you said it gave you it gave you money doesn't mean that it did. We have to still actually event that in. So under that, make sure to add change gold, which is your currency, increase by. What did I say? Hundred. Did I say hundred and twenty? All right. Cool. So when he's if you say no. Paste that in again. Suit yourself. All right, so here's a problem. This will continuously happen now till the end of time. You will be able to just keep talking to them and getting money over and over, which we do not want. So that's where we're gonna get into self switches. Um, basically, so you've got switches, which means it affects the entire game, and then you've got self switches, which only affects in this case, Farmer Grandpa, and you've got A, B, C, D. So let's say if you said yes, you want it to switch to event A. So that's where you would say control self switch A. Okay. But if you said no, we're going to say control self switch B. And what this will do is anytime you talk to him after doing this once, he will have a different response based on what you said. So we're going to say new actually yeah new event page oh actually no the best thing to do is copy the event page because we've got all his movement as art everything copy paste now we're going to go in here and select everything and delete and then you're going to once again copy and paste so one is for a and one is for b so here event a which is if you said yes and he gave you money now he will say, enjoy that money, sweet cheeks. 
and now that's all he will say. But let's say you said no and you were rude to him. Now he's not interested in you. He's going to go find another sugar baby. Move along. I need to find a sweet thing to pamper. We're going to move that to the next line so it doesn't cut off. Make sure that... All right. God, I don't know what kind of game I'm making, but all right. So we've got all that sorted. Okay, let's test it out. So let's talk to him. Hey there, you've got some huge ambitions. Oh ho ho. Would you like me to be your sugar daddy? Yes, daddy. Oh yeah, I'm going to make it rain. Farm grandpa is giving you $120. So now if I check my inventory, look at that, I got $120. And now if I talk to him again, enjoy that money, sweet cheeks, and that's all he will say. So there you go, that's how you do that. Um, and it's a pretty simple system. Um, you can use this for so many things. So for your homework, I want you to make two more NPCs and make at least one of them ask a question so that you can set up a system similar to this. And once you're done with that, I will see you in the next video. I hope you're having fun. Let's make some games.